function is the concept based on superclass and subclass properties the properties contained in the superclass will will automatically drawn back to its subclasses as well like in this example a university is employee every employee from minor to major contains these properties name id age and raw salary this main superclass is called as abstract class as well abstract class is the main superclass of the whole generalization process now employee is divided into two parts temporary and permanent the basic reason for division of this part is that these two subclasses will have something different than its main class temporary workers will contain the properties of working hours and permanent will have holidays and a bonus as well temporary worker do not contain holidays and bonus and permanent workers permanent worker not only contains holidays and bonus it will also contain the properties of name id age and raw salary inherited from its superclass then the permanent worker is divided into two parts the lecturer and the phd doctor both have different properties the basic reason of division is that both contain different properties lecturer contains hcc number and courses he teaches and phd doctor contains i triple e number and publications of the particular phd doctor the lecturer and phd doctors superclass is permanent and permanent superclass is employee here we can say that lecturer not only contains hcc number and course property it will also have the properties of holidays bonus also name id age and raw salary it is inheriting from its superclasses let's take another example of generalization to clear our concepts we are dividing employee into four uh, subclasses of lecturer phd doctor watchman and peon now if a situation occurs when two classes contains exactly the same properties is like watchman and peon are containing exact three same properties of duty hours office fund and festival bonus we can combine the both classes into one and name it as we like so again if the two classes contain exactly the same properties we can combine the both into one to reduce the complexities of the program if the situation occurs when most of the properties of two classes match like in this case watchman and peon's properties three properties are matching one extra property of both uh, watchman containing extra time and peon containing medical facilities so what we will do in this case is that the similar properties are combined in one class and then make subclass of the different properties from the ones like in this case so again reminder if two classes contain exactly same properties combine the class two classes contains a substantial amount of properties similar and there are few there are few properties that are different then combine the properties and make it another class and the different properties of the classes are separated and so again in this class we can say that all the subclasses contain the properties of its superclasses means if we take example of watchman it is containing the property of extra time from its watchman class then it also contains properties of duty hours office funds and festival bonus from its superclass of worker contain also containing the properties of name id and address of from its main superclass employee employee here is the abstract class an abstract class is the main superclass of the process